The process for me with graffiti or aerosol art is all um, using spray paint. There's no brushes involved. Um, it's all freehand, so I don't use stencils either or masking tape generally. Uh, so everything is large scale um, and I use, yeah, mostly spray paint. So um, we, I can cover a lot, you know, a big kind of area in a short space of time due to the different nozzles and, and stuff like that. So it's really hard wearing paint, you know, it's designed for outdoor use um, and, you know, it lends itself to, to painting murals on anything, whether it's cars, uh, vehicles, walls, canvas, because of its longevity and, and how long it can last. Aerosol art and graffiti and is a great tool because it can it can create amazing murals in public spaces it can inspire people it can send a message uh, it could be a, you know especially when used in a positive way um, you know it, it can it can brighten people's day up even if it's as simple as just brightening up your walk to work and you know it's a great way to engage with young people and inspire them to learn how to paint and use spray paint as a tool you know rather than for negative purposes they can learn to use it as a tool the same way you'd learn to use a brush and oil paintings or watercolor and you know enjoy creativity through spray paint as a medium and graffiti it's a great way to express yourself even if it's just writing your name and traditional graffiti uh, or if you've got something else you want to say you know on a political or creative message it's it's a really good really good for society to be able to put it out there mm -hmm.